All right, so last thing I want to talk about here uh, is just how to beat the lake pass. You know, I think um, even when I was in high school, you, you didn't have to worry about this as much, but something in the past probably 15 years, I would say, with, with Ben Askren, you've seen more of this funk wrestling, you know, and guys call it scrambling, but it's really not scrambling. If, if you know the technique, guys, it's good skill, and you got to know how to beat it, right? So, you know, we would wrestle Missouri a lot in college, and, certain guys in their program, and then, you know, um, around the country, you're seeing it more, okay? So you, you have to know what to do here. Anytime you're in on a leg, there's some guys who will try to fall off and, and pass a leg and create a scramble, okay? So I'm here, let's say, let's say I just shoot a sweep single leg, right? Maybe he kind of half scroll. There'll be guys that'll fall over and start trying to grab my leg and pass it over his head here and create a scramble, okay? Now, if I just stayed here, he would raise up, get his knees under him, right? And start trying to reach back, okay? So, a lot of people don't really know what to do here, okay? I don't want to let him split my legs, all right, and have and end up across his body, okay? So if he goes and he passes my leg, what I don't want to do is try to stay here and start fighting. I'm not going to win this position, guys, all right? You know, in college, they have the neutral danger count now where if I'm able to keep him here for, I think it's three seconds, you know, maybe I'll get a two-point two point takedown, but that's hard to hold the man. All he's got to do is rock off his back, right? you know, whether that way or rock this way for a second and then come back. You got to hold them there for three straight seconds, okay? And in high school, there is no neutral danger rule, okay? So I would not suggest letting him split my legs and have one side, one leg on this side of the body and one leg on this side of the body. What I teach is just high leg over and go with it, all right? If this is something you practice, you should feel it right away, and as he goes to pass that leg, I'm going to go with it and start looking for a cross face, a reverse half, and I'm going to get back points, okay? So, I'm hitting the single leg, he falls over, he starts passing my leg, right away I'm going to go with it. All right, now I'm going to start cross facing and reverse halfing and sprawling my legs back. Okay? Again, just think about it like that. I'm helicoptering over, and I'm going with it. He's doing the work for me. All right, here he goes to pass my leg. Okay, what I don't want to let him do here is get back to his belly and start elevating my leg up. All right, so as soon as you high leg over, you got to understand it's not, it's not game over yet. Okay, I still got to really sprawl my legs back and cross face, it's still a fight there. You know, and again, you'll end up in this position from, from any leg attack. Let's say I even went double leg and I planked him on his hip. Okay, he, he could start doing that. Okay, but single leg, right? I'm here, he falls off and passes my leg. Go with it. All right, one more time here, a little slower. Down here, falls off, he passes my leg, go with it. Cross face, reverse half, back points, get the pin here if you can. 